One man who loved a showdown was Tony Modra. He joins us on the program, all thanks to Thoroughbred Racing. There is nothing like a day at the races. I think if we had training at 4am every day, I wouldn't be a footballer anymore. I think I would have took up soccer or tennis or something like that. I try to get to the races as much as I can. I'm a bit of an ambassador actually for the SA Racing, so it's been good to get out to these places. The earliest memory of coming to the races would have to be when I was a kid. I think I was about 13 or 14. I was up at Mindary Halliden when I lived at Loxton. I loved it. Festival racing is a really good atmosphere for, for owners and friends and families to get to the races. This girl will probably bring a few to the races. She's probably got a couple of hundred owners and their families coming to the races to watch her race over the next couple of weeks. So it's a, a really good atmosphere and environment and a really good bonding session for everyone to get together. There's a lot of similarities between obviously footy players and horses because they're both athletes. Both have to warm up and cool down and prepare right and uh, they have a pre-season before they get to the races as the footy players do so I think there's a lot of similarities. I think winning a race would be probably similar feeling to winning an AFL game that's for sure. I think jockey would be harder than being a footy player only because we have to be a lot stricter on our diet and everything like that and you know we probably train just as hard as them. So I left Adelaide unfortunately at the end of 98 and got traded to Fremantle but I've, I came back about five years later and I'm working back at the club now and enjoying every minute of it and I love taking the family down there to watch every home game. Well the SANFL to South Australia is fantastic, it's a good stepping stone to the AFL for all these local players and I think we need to try and get more of them coming into the Adelaide Football Club. So the grand final at the MCG every year, I think it's a bit unfortunate for especially players interstate, so because it's a national competition now, it would be good to share it around, so I'd like to see that, but it all depends on when another over can hold the capacity of what the MCG does. I've had a number of best players of the Adelaide Footy Club I've played with, for instance Darren Jarman, Mark Rusciutio, Nigel Smart for instance, so yeah, no, I enjoy playing with all of them, and then Andrew McLeod as well, he was a gun. My favourite Adelaide crow at the moment would have to be Eddie because I love just watching him back, so hopefully he's back out in the ground soon and just watching some of his goals, he kicks it unbelievable. And he says, I'm yeah, I did come to the races a fair bit while I was playing football because it was a bit of a de-stretch, like you come out here and get involved in the crowds and the experience of race day and just a good getaway, I loved it. One of our absolute favourites there, Tony Modra, 